what's up guys and today we are going to be checking out and unboxing slash review this razor gaming mouse i just got it in the mail today we just went to pick it up um there's two things a um what's it called thing stand for the camera i'll show it to you now it's this try oh yeah try it's this here so we got the little video mic and everything. So what we got, it's all like kebabble. I don't know why it's like that, but you know, this is a tripod for our camera. It's blue and black, provides a good color. So I'm just gonna place it back on the table. Like it's supposed to be, okay. So now that it's placed on our table, we're going to get right into this Razer Gaming Mouse. Uh, I have a wireless mouse. It's not It's not an official company. It's a Chani thing. It's a wireless mouse I have downstairs. It's not Razer. And um, it's getting very weird because it moves on its own. My Fortnite gameplay moves on its own because of the mouse. So, um, like if I move this way with the mouse... The uh, figure will go the other way. And it's not in my settings because I looked at it all. But anyway. Um, so now we got a new mouse to fix all that. So we're just, I'm, gonna, I'm taking off the top tape here. It's pretty easy because it gives you like a little tab to start with. So it shouldn't be too long. Yep. And it's already. Tape's already off. Here. So, and every single time you get one, it should have like this little pull tab where you can just pull up your thing. But see, this opens, and then you pull on the tab, and then it should come up. Oh, wait, no, it doesn't. Pull it out. Ooh, instructions or something? For gamers by gamers. It says here, and on the back, it has the razor things, and it's, this is just a manual book. Okay, so this one's not wireless, so I pretty much downgrade from a wireless. Actually, no. A wireless is a downgrade of a non-wireless. So I guess I'm going to upgrade it. Oh, my. That's our gaming mouse. Oh, sounds cool. Oh, we just fell off its packet. Oh, okay, great. Hey, what's this here? Looks like some accessories. These two. So I don't know what this is, but it's some accessory. Oh, dropped it. Some accessory here. Then we have another one. Yeah, there's only two accessories. So if you get this mouse, make sure you look at the very side. Right here they were. Okay, I like this mouse. I like this mouse. I like it. Oh, there's a little tab. A little ASMR. Sweet. It's a little, like, plastic. Wait, where's my microphone? So on the bottom, it has like all these weird controls. I don't know what they are. So like right here, dial. Right here is its profile. I don't really know. But I hope this works with the PC. Ooh, it has a Razer logo on the very bottom right here. Do you see that? This is a lit mouse. I like this mouse. This is better than any other mouse I bought. Oh, actually, no. My auntie bought this. I'll shout it to my auntie. She bought it for me. For Valentine's Day.
Where does these extra buttons go? I don't understand. Um, does it go on the bottom? What does it do? Do they even do anything? For the side things to be replaced. Oh. Okay, so we got that one, which is long, and then we got this one, which is short. Oh, so it's like an adjustment. I kind of like the longer one better, so I'm going to take this one off. See, look. You take this off. Take it off. It's a longer one right here. Just magnetize it on. Right there. I'm not sure what this is for though. Oh, is this like a very small piece? Oh, you can cover this up. I like that. So if I don't want that, I can cover it up. See? That's pretty cool. So I can replace the parts of the mouse. That's awesome. So I don't so if I get older and my thing get and my like thumbs get longer, then I can do that. Or if I just get too bad with it, I can plug it up. That's pretty cool. I like that feature. But here's the mouse itself. It has two buttons up here. This is a gear mouse, it's mechanical, so it just goes like that. Nice little sound. Uh, buttons on the bottom, for some unknown reason, like I don't know. Like it's this profile and you can tap it and it's resistance and it goes up and down. Scrolls up and down. So I don't really know what to do with what that is. But yeah, this is the mouse right here. This is where your thumb is lodged, right here. And then... Side buttons. This can be replaced. It's kind of like rubbery right here for some reason. But, yeah. I'm thinking that the scroll wheel lights up. Anyway, yeah. We're going to go... I'm going to um, edit this and fast forward to downstairs. Where I'm going to show you um, my old setup to the new one. With the new mouse. So, so now yeah. we're in my gaming station in my basement. And um, I'm just going to unwrap the cables. On my mouse, and I have my new mouse, and then yeah, I'm gonna show you guys my old mouse. It's like an off Chinese brand. Uh, right here is wireless, blue and black. I got rid of the old keyboard and got a Ducky One Two Mini instead. So yeah, I had this one for a while, quite a while. It has side buttons as well, two, and one in the middle. This one has two uh, top buttons. Um, a gear scroll wheel, two buttons on the side, including the one that's replaceable. So, yeah, we're going to unwrap it right here. Or plastic thing. So, yeah. Oh, this is a super long cable. That's good because if your PC is very far away, then you're not going to have a very long cable. Is this unpluggable? No, it's not. It's not wireless, so there's the USB. <clears throat> to plug it in. And now we're going to replace it. So here's what it looks like with the old mouse. Wait. Let's wait a second. You're wait on my gaming chair for a minute. So here's what it looks like with the old mouse, wait, wait, I'll do it this way, I'll show you, so it looks like, this is my ducky one too many here, that lights up, and that's the mouse at the setup, so now I'm going to show you what my new mouse looks with it, okay, go the old mouse, ooh, there's like little green highlights in my, in the USB, that's sick, okay, Put 
behind my monitor. Take the old uh, mouse USB here. So here's my old mouse USB. And now I got the new one. It lights up. No freaking way. How do you change it? I think it just goes random. So, see, look. And it goes off for a minute. Yeah, tap it. It changes, like, different colors. That's lit. I really like this. It's big and bulky, but it's a very nice one. See, look. Spray your thumb lays. So it'll look a bit like this. That's. Oh, I think I know what the bottom buttons are for now. Changing the color. It is too. Yeah, bottom buttons change color. I like the pink. Wait, is there blue? Is there blue? I like the blue. Okay, well, we'll change it after, guys. You don't need to see that. But, yeah, I want to show you what it looks like. Full setup now, because this looks fire. Oh, it's green now. Okay. Well, I'll show you what it, got, what it looks like. Oh, it's blue now. Lit. And here's my thing. It's blue. That's blue. Then we got everything else here. This is the monitor. I got a big fat ass one. It doesn't got all mouse and things. Oh, I tap it in because my Xbox is not on. So we'll just change colors. This stays blue for some unknown reason. I don't know how to change the color on the other one too many. But we're going to start up the Xbox. Oh my god. That's the mouse. And this is everything. So yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you all next time. Bye.